section, have you wildin'? Last minute trips to the highlands. Trip, trip, trip when you slide in. What's going on everyone? Welcome back to my channel. This morning I am headed to my brokerage. So that means your girl is trying to get back into her real estate game, y'all. I am, you know, ready to take my career serious. I'm not gonna say I was thrown off because, you know, Rylan is the best thing that ever happened. But I did get pregnant right after I got my license. So I was really sick in the beginning, of course, of my pregnancy, whatever. I'm here now. Let's talk about it. I am ready to take my career serious. I'm ready to jump off the porch in the real estate game and really get to going. So I'm headed this morning to a training that we are having at my brokerage, Keller Williams West Atlanta, baby. Yeah. I haven't been to the brokerage in a, a minute, like literally since last year. So I'm really excited to see, you know, just the other agents, although I don't know them. I just love seeing people. Honestly, I love people. And I'm really the most excited to see my operating principal. Her name is Gabby. She is like a millennial, okay? Gabby is really doing her big one. I love Gabby. She's so, so, so motivating. She's such an inspiration. I just love Gabby. So I really can't wait to see her. And I'm excited to see what the training is going to give today. So I will, you know, try to sneak some clips in. It'd be so, like, professional. You see, I got my professional shirt on. So, yeah, I'm not really going to be trying you know record but i'm gonna try to get some clips and i'm gonna show y'all what it's giving because it's giving real suit and tie today huh uh, all right i'm gonna catch up with y'all when i get in there this actually um i pulled up a random i have no idea what this is but i pulled up a random one to show you um this was a one-on-one -on -one meeting okay so this is tony he's a real estate agent give us him action items from this 30 minute call here's the meeting agenda here's the full summary Hey, Lord, this is blog. Let me tell you guys, if you are not doing business with her, you are missing out. She is trained, equipped, and super sufficient as a realtor. And she understands the technology pieces she needs to survive in this industry and for you to survive and make great investments. I just left the training and it was really good, you guys. So we went over 10 AI tools that we can use as real estate agents to implement into our business that can help us out. What's crazy is a lot of the stuff that the guest speaker, his name was Phil Stringer, a lot of the stuff that he was teaching us about is even stuff that I could use when I'm making reels and shorts, TikToks, whatever. So I thought that was super dope, like the connection that I can use in both aspects of my life, real estate and content creating. I like that. Also, I told you I wasn't going to be able to really record, you know, because it's so serious, serious vibes. Like, we are in a workplace. Got to be serious. <laughs> y'all seen a little clip, you know, of what was going on, as well as y'all seen my OP. That's my girl, Gabby, y'all. Please don't play with Gabby. And Gabby just had a baby, too. And that's really, like, my motivation. When I look at Gabby and I see that, first of all, again, let me be very clear. Gabby is the first millennial operating principal of a Keller Williams come on that's so major like what and she's from Atlanta Georgia like I just love her and to know that she looks at me so highly she speaks of me so highly you know it's just a great mentor to have I just really do love Gabby and I can't wait to see where my career flourishes to being up underneath her I'm really excited though to you know be getting back into the real estate field get my career going and pop and sell some houses baby i'm so excited so now i'm on the way home to get rylan i do need to just do a few things around the house really quick i'm not sure if we're gonna get out today we'll probably go to the park but if we don't i am just gonna clean up the house i have made it back home to harry t what's up rylan is asleep period so I do need to clean up this house so I'm gonna do that I'm gonna take off my clothes and stuff you know get comfortable and just get my day going for real cuz my morning is out the way now I should probably clean up I have changed my clothes so now me and Rylan are about to head out I put her on some clothes say hi okay and I gave her a little swoop instead of a ponytail cuz y'all know I always do a ponytail so we're about to head out we gotta run some errands and we're going to catch up in the car because I need to be getting out of here. We have made it back home. I totally forgot to pick up the camera because I was all over the place. It was traffic time. But y'all see, 
this kitchen, right? I'm going to show y'all better in detail. Because I never show y'all when I be like, my house is dirty. My house is dirty. Yeah, it's really dirty. So I'm going to show y'all. And I'm going to clean up. Rylan is still asleep. So I got a little time on my hand. Let's see what I can do. And I just don't even think I'm going to lay her down because I'm on a time crunch. I gave her a little swoop though. Period, mummies. Everything is literally a mess. Like, ugh, okay. So I gotta just get all of this, the whole house together. The kitchen table is filthy, like, ugh. And here is the update. Dishes clean, countertops, everything wiped down. Yeah. Now I have not been able to get over here because y'all niece. Don't woke up, child. But overall, everything is looking clean. Once those dry, of course, I will be putting them up. And y'all, so when the summertime comes around, my house gets like crazy with gnats. It's so annoying. And I think it's because I'm by all these trees, you know, but I don't know. So if y'all have like some tips to get rid of the gnats, please tell your girl, please. Now I'm gonna go upstairs because Rylan is getting cranky. So it's seven o'clock. She's probably, you know, getting tired. She's gonna want a bottle soon. I'm gonna wait till about 8.30 to start doing that. She's gonna watch a little TV. I'm gonna do some work that I need to do. I need to edit a video. I'm just gonna go chill on the balcony for a second. Rylan will be relaxing while I'm doing so. And once I'm done with my video, I am going to, of course, get her ready for bed. So I'll be able to finish the kitchen probably like later tonight, you know? So I decided to come out on my balcony and just edit my video. I would usually do it in my room or like in my office or something. But it's a nice day. Well, it's like getting nighttime now, but I got my new chair, y'all. So I'm really trying to utilize it. And I get a little break. Rylan's in there watching Gracie. I could see her right here. I couldn't ask for more. So I'm getting this little video done. Then I'm gonna get her ready for bed. Uh, hopefully we have a good you know nighttime process everything has been going good except for maybe like like three nights ago or four nights ago actually last week she was like i don't know she had woke up in the middle of the night and then didn't go back to sleep for like an hour that's not normal but it only happened like maybe once or twice i need to get on the schedule so i need to be knocking this video out so that i can get my baby ready for bed I also need to wash bottles, so I got a lot of mommy stuff I need to be doing. But in the meantime, I'm going to finish editing my video. It's looking so cute. I'm loving the new way I just did my haul. Be sure to tune into my haul. Love y'all. What's up, baby? Rylan is having a little concert, a little Gracie time. Oh, we're about to put her in the bathtub. Let's go take a bath, Momo. Okay. I huff and puff. I huff and puff. I huff. Then they blow the house down. <laughs> they be, ah, no, no, no. Rylan is already sleepy, so she's like a little cranky here in the bathtub. But we're going to get this bath in because it's already time to go to sleep. Time is over. Yay! Cause you were not happy, girl. I'm with you. How can I lose and miss 
the moment You were just too important Nobody who bites like you do Rylan literally was screaming to the top of her lungs, I tell you Now she's silent as a whistle Her whistles are not silent But she's literally quiet She's drinking this milk and she's falling asleep So, once she goes to sleep I'll be able to get myself together and ready for bed Hopefully I'll be able to clean up the kitchen too Hi, Jade. Hey, y'all. Oh, we are going swimming today, so we're at Publix because we're going to get us some sandwiches. You know, the sandwich in the pool vibe is like A1. Zanik, Beja, and Hunter are over there. They're already standing in line. I'm trying to see if I could just get a pre-sub. I might just get me a sub, though. As soon as we leave here, we are headed to the pool, and we are going to have a good time. It is Ryland's first time at the pool. Can you say hi? Okay. <laughs> Are you ready to go swimming for the first time? Oh, Moo Moo. It was a long line for the sandwiches, but we are finally like at the counter. So if y'all know, the public be having the best sandwiches, but now I like going to Kroger. I ain't gonna lie. Hi. Oh, I see her. There she goes. Hi. 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 JD. Hi. You already I'm said hi. what I wanna eat. I don't like it. What? You don't like public subs? That bread is too hard. The meat is too much. The, the meat is, is too. You gotta get boar's head honey maple turkey. And they put like fifteen slices on it. The bread be kind of like. Uh 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 uh. But like. Get some milk. This is what Jade is getting. Lunchable. And you know we worked out today, so I got the baked chips. Okay. <laughs> and that's how you do it. Is it? That's the balance. <laughs> we have secured the sandwiches, and now we are headed to Walgreens. I thought we was headed to the pool, but we are going to Walgreens because my baby don't have a float, and neither do Hunter. So let's get these kids some floats, show. Please look how ready we are, y'all. I am crying. Period. It's good. <laughs> My sister is the best sister. Get your niece right. Yeah, I'm trying to. <laughs> like, this is. <laughs> Riley. Do you like the pool? Say, girl, I'm barely in it. Get it, girl. Get it, girl. Are you having fun? Now you're in the water. Okay, look. Oh. Oh, oh, get it, girl. <laughs> oh, <laughs> okay. Is that fun? Is that, is that fun? Is that so much fun? Riley has on a little ice cream cone. Okay. And somebody has had them such a good time that they are sleeping. <laughs> We are wrapping up at the pool, you guys. We had us a great time. Rylan is still asleep. Everybody, how did y'all have? How much so fun much did y'all have? Looking so tanned, you know. Yeah, really <laughs> so tanned. Yeah. We had a great time. We are about to pack up all of this stuff so we can get to the house. I need to take a shower. I need to put my baby in the bath. The day was good, though. The day was good. We are back at home and Rylan is about to take a bath. She had a great time at the pool, y'all. She really likes the water. Uh, I love that for me. I know I love a pool, so being that she likes the pool, like that is a plus, an extra plus. Did you have fun today, mommy? What? You're just looking at yourself. Oh, you can't get it. But we had a really good time. She is about to prepare for a bath. Well, I love y'all. It is time for me to get Ryla ready for bed. I will see y'all on the next vlog. I love you guys.